Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel with the Patachi Mini 110cc fully automatic ATV for kids. It's a single cylinder, four stroke with electric start. This is the most entry level beginners ATV on a budget that you can purchase on the market. It is a Chinese ATV, whether it's Tao Tao, Coolster, or Apollo, or Vitachi. They're generally all the same. They have approximately a 23 inch seat height from the ground up. And that would be from the center point over here down to the ground, you guys. It has drum brakes in the front. It has a disc brake in the back. I do want to highlight the safety features on this ATV. It does include the very popular and important speed restrictor here on the left, right side of the handlebars, you guys. It limits the travel of the thumb throttle. This is your lanyard, safety lanyard that gets pulled out. That shuts down the motor immediately. And also, you have on the left side here, you guys, you have the uh, on and off switch over here. This controls your lights, your starter button over here. This is the rear parking brake on this here. This is called a Hawk, whether it's the Boulder from Tao Tao, they're all generally the same. So we've got uh, the hard plastic foot guards on both sides. This is your gas tank, it's a hard plastic cap on here. That rear brake, you guys, that operates the rear. It's a solid rear axle, as you can see. Rear mono shock, pretty decent, very sturdy, great entry level. Definitely an ATV on a budget. These are all Chinese. They use the Honda replica clone motors, four stroke with electric start. So you can see the hydraulic brake, master cylinder here. This is the caliper here, colored in red. This is your parking brake function here for the for the rear as well six inch wheels you guys all the way around this activates right here your rear brake this activates your front drum it does have a locking feature here as well for the front drum so it's in essence you can call it a parking let's take a closer look here at the engine this is your spark plug right over here we get that further deep down you can remove this cover you guys adam here is going to help me out so you have now access to your carburetor on the right side. This right here will allow you to adjust your idle. This would be your mixture. Your EPA requires uh, the manufacturer to seal the cap on this, but you can watch the video I made on how to remove this cap. Just go to my playlist and you'll find that video. This is the key switch right here. It does have that remote shut off as well. That key right here, switch, it goes in here. It's part of the starting procedures take a close look of the front you can see the drum brakes the drum brakes cables the shocks here it's decent you guys i mean for a budget if you're definitely looking for a beginner's atv solid front bumper this model does not have reverse these little tiny ones most all of them do not have reverse you guys you have to jump up to the rxr or the ones that have the seven inch wheels then generally you'll have reverse on the reflectors so highlighting the safety features you guys the affordability is amazing i'd say probably this is the world's cheapest atv on the market chinese wise that you can purchase great way to get your kids started without spending a major brand price you guys adam's going to start it up from here at run again it does not have reverse Fully automatic, add throttle and go. Let's check under the seat here, Adam. This is where they store your battery, you guys. It has a metal gas tank under here, really easy to put back on. This is so easy to drive, very easy to handle for the kids. As I mentioned before, this is your lanyard that gets pulled. It shuts down the motor immediately. You put this back in. This is part of the starting procedure. Adam will help me with that. So to start it, you guys, that needs to be plugged in. The key switch has to be on, on, and then this switch has to be on, and then we go ahead. Okay, and the, and the uh, brake handle needs to be pulled. When you pull in the brake handle or step on the brake, it engages the starter system. A lot of safety. We love to highlight the safety. All right, so the weight capacity on this is about 100 pounds. I've been trying to persuade Adam to see if he would ride it. Now, of course, this is only for demonstration purposes and he's being real gentle on it 
But this will show you how much torque it has. Adam's six foot four, 240 pounds, you guys. He's just gonna do a really short ride because he's far too heavy for this ATV. Go ahead, Adam. Let's uh, see how it operates. You can see the torque in this. Now, again, you don't want to ride. If you're an adult this size, by no means you do want to ride this. He's riding it really, really light. Has a nice sharp LED uh, front bulb on this particular one. Again, again this is called the Patachi Hawk 110cc four-stroke electric start single cylinder air-cooled. We'll catch you on the next video. Thanks, Adam, for your assistance. And we'll see you guys soon. Take care.